Hello YouTube. When I visited Frank from the tiny workshop the last time, we uh, as usual uh, exchanged uh, wood and one of the things he gave me was uh, this piece of acacia. Actually it was a bit longer but I've cut uh, off a piece and uh, I want to try and make this uh, into uh, a butt face. Never turned uh, acacia before, at least not that I'm aware of. So uh, we'll see uh, how this goes. Uh, it has been sealed on, on the on the end that was uh, on the outside. I, it feels pretty dry, and I'm afraid that the bark yeah, that will not hold up. That's uh, that's for sure. Too bad, but uh, all right. So we'll uh, put this between centers and see what we can do with it. That's the piece squared off and um, created the tenon for my SE3. So I'll go ahead and uh, mount it uh, in the chuck. Got it mounted in the chuck now and uh, I'm uh, trying to do a few measurements. From the bud phases I've made so far, I know that uh, you have to have a certain ratio between the uh, the body part and the neck, so to say, uh, in order to make them look decent. And um, that's about uh, two to one. So uh, one third for the neck, two third for the for the body. This uh, one uh, is sticking out 15 centimeters. I intend to uh, to part it off uh, close to the to the jaws. So it means that I'm going to uh, um, have uh, six centimeters for the neck. I've already put uh, a mark there. I'll make it a bit clearer with my pencil and another one here which is the, um, so to say, the center of the, of the neck. Uh, it will be a curve. And I intend to uh, end up uh, somewhere here, um, like this. And then, of course, the base should, uh, yeah, we'll see. But the idea is... Uh, Like this, and like this.
drill chuck uh, has been set up. I'm pre-drilling with uh, a 7 millimeters and then uh, going in with the 12. As you can see it has to go in all the way. So here's the first bug vase, sanded up to 400. I'm going to clean it off with some uh, alcohol. It's really pretty wood. Thank you, Frank. And then uh, for the finish. I think I'm going to uh, go for uh, tongue oil. Smells nice, food safe. has its own wax, good stuff. Quite nice and shiny. The vase is looking really good with two coats of tongue oil. I've put uh, a steel rod in my drill chuck uh, which fits in the hole so that it doesn't go flying on me when I uh, part it off, which is next.
I saw some movement, so I thought I was already there, but it needs a little more. As you see, I'm going in at an angle to make sure that uh, afterwards uh, the vase will uh, rest uh, on the outside edge of the of the bottom. I think uh, we are good uh, in that respect. So uh, I need to take a little more wood. I think in all this one took me 45 minutes, so uh, not too bad for uh, the first one of a series. I'll uh, make a few more of this. <laughs> <laughs> 